Hey guys, I'm Coach Tenney. I coach swim and water polo here on campus, and I'm also a seventh period PE teacher. I'm Coach DeCosta. I teach uh, weight training at Close West High School, and I also coach football and track. Hi, my name is Mary Brooks, and I am a water polo coach and a swim coach here at Clovis West. Hey, this is Coach Lee. Um, I teach uh, PE and coach girls softball. Hi, hey, I'm Coach Gilchrist. I teach one class of wrestling PE, and I'm the director of sport for wrestling here at Clovis West as well. Hi, I'm Maddie Dinsdale. I'm a PE teacher, and I coach volleyball and badminton. Hi, I'm Taylor Heckethorn. I'm a PE teacher, and I coach boys water polo and boys swimming. Hey, everyone. I'm Coach Castro. I teach PE and coach boys and girls tennis. Hi, my name is Rhonda DeRuder. I teach PE here at Clovis West, and I also coach our girls volleyball program. Hi, I'm Coach Brown. I coach football and teach PE. Hi, my name is Kevin Patrick. I teach PE, and I'm the director of sport for baseball. I'm Coach Sonetti. I teach PE here at Clovis West High School, and I also coach boys and girls golf. Hello, Clovis West. I am Ms. Wetzel, and I run the dance PE here at Clovis West High School. I also am in charge of selling all of our PE clothes out of the student store. And I am Coach Walbrick. I'm the PE department head here at Clovis West, and I also coach uh, the boys basketball and the girls badminton. Here at Clovis West, we look for a total package student with mind, body, and spirit at the front of it all. We're hoping that your child will choose to participate. As long as they participate and dress out on a daily basis, they will pass PE. There's no reason your son or daughter should ever come home with less than an A in PE. We, for me, PE is play and enjoy. We want them to go out, we want them to have fun. So if they participate, they dress out every day and they participate, they will end up with an A in the class. If for some reason they might struggle on a test or two, they always have a chance to do makeups. Our makeups are every Thursday and Friday morning. They need to be in the gym anytime between 6.30 and 7. It's a half hour makeup, and the majority of the time they will do that with me. Um, most of our classes, most, our core classes and our 11, 12 classes, they will dress out with the regular clothes that Coach Wessel is gonna talk about. I do wanna talk about our weight classes. Our weight classes are kind of our specialty classes. We will have football weights, basketball weights, baseball weights, we have badminton weights, we have side. Every sport we have, we have weights for those classes. Each of those special classes, that teacher is gonna have designated dress for that class. This is different from the normal PE. For example, in my class, the boys basketball, they're gonna have black shirt, black shorts. If they don't come with a black shirt or black short, they start with a cement lap each day. That's about a half a mile. So they understand how we want them to dress. Again, if they dress properly, they're going to be fine. And talking about dress, going to let Coach Wessel finish it. Yes, thank you so much, Coach Wahlberg. So going into dressing out, it's really important every day. We need the kids in the proper shoes, proper attire, which would be gray top, black bottoms. And I'm going to show you right now a few examples. If you find that you're having trouble getting your PE clothes, you can always come talk to us as teachers. You can reach out to the SOAR department. There's no reason for any student on campus to not have the proper attire. Our regular daily attire, as Coach Wahlberg and I are showing you, is that we've got the short sleeve gray Clovis West PE shirt and the black Clovis West PE shorts, each $15 and can be purchased at any time during the school year in our student store. We also, when the weather gets a little bit chillier, we have a long sleeve version for $20, and we even offer a variety of gray sweatshirts. And all of these items interchangeably can also be used as spirit wear, with the exception of the shorts, to go to any football game, any basketball game, badminton, uh, baseball, softball, volleyball, you name it, you can wear it and you can show off your eagle pride. So remember, if you're having trouble you can always come talk to us as individual teachers, reach out to the SOAR department, but we wanna make sure all of our classes look the same and are working closely together. And again, remember, if your student does not come home with an A and PE, you need to find out why. And I'll guarantee you, most likely, it's probably because they didn't dress out, they're not participating as they should. Please help us, please stay on top of them, and we will help your son and daughter also. We look forward to seeing you, and we will make sure that we've got our handbook uploaded to the Clovis West website, where you can access and see all policies and procedures not covered tonight. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.